What is the most forgotten minigame in RuneScape? Well, I guess it would be Trouble Brewing, because I remember when I was going for Completion Escape, it took a really long time to collect 6 people to start that minigame. But the Fight Cauldron could be one of the most forgotten minigames as well. By the way, I have no idea how to pronounce the Cauldron, so, you know, I guess I should have checked the pronunciation. Anyway, this is a minigame where you go in and you fight the waves of monsters. By the way, there is no ending, so you can leave at any time. There is no end game boss like Chad or anything. Sometimes you will encounter this boss. It's kind of easy to kill, I guess. It could be harder if you're lower level, but you just kill it. And every single time it will drop a lamp that you can use on any combat skill, including summoning and prayer to give you 20,000 experience. And I managed to get 15 of those, I think, during 10 hours. So that's like 300,000 period experience during the 10 hours of Fight Cauldron. So it's not too bad. And this minigame is also designed for the combat experience and not the drops themselves. So at the end, you're gonna see the drops and don't expect to see anything spectacular. And I would say experience is actually really good. It's around 400,000 experience an hour. That also includes the prayer and the HP and everything, not just one specific skill. So it is, is it fun? I don't know, I guess it is something different. If you're bored of killing something, you can just go in here and try this minigame out. I mean, I mean, it's it's something new, I guess. So that's really all about that minigame. So let's just go to the price check and you can see that. Oh, by the way, I totally forgot to, to tell something. Um, the best drop that you can get from this cave is Uncut Onyx. But unfortunately, as you can see, I did not manage to get one. It is quite rare to get one. Um, I got tons of obsidian items. Like, they're so cheap, I have no idea. Like, there's gonna be one. Oh yeah, 14,000 for this one. Like, all of those, I think, they have reached their ALK price. So really, so let's just price check everything. So 5.4 million from 10 hours of Fight Cauldron. Again, this is for experience and not to drop. So this is really decent, I would say, but I think it's because of the bonus experience weekend because you can see the ores and you can see the gems in here. So it would be a little bit less. And these are untradeable. You use these to repair your armor. By the way, if you are doing this mini game, you have to make this obsidian armor. Otherwise it will be harder because all of this set gives like 50% damage reduction in the cave. So it's cool. And um, yeah, when you are doing the cave and when you leave the cave, you will get these obsidian shards. And if you die, then you will get only half of those. So I could have collected around 3.5 thousand, I believe, but I just died quite a lot because I tried to stay in the cave for as long as I can. It was like my personal challenge, even though you can just leave at any time. It gives you no penalty for leaving earlier. So the longer you stay, you don't get more shards or anything like that. It's just for personal gain, I guess. But yeah, that's about all this cave. So thanks for watching and I guess I will see you next time. So bye.